Hello, today I'm going to show you how you can open Toshiba satellite, the model is uh, C55. I have to replace the hard drive on this laptop, I'm going to put the SSD one. So since I gotta open it, I decide to make a quick video just to show you how you can open it, clean it and uh, change the thermal paste uh, if you need to. Uh, this laptop actually is uh, pretty easy to be open. The first thing you gotta do of course, like on every laptop, we have to remove the battery. It's held by two screws here on the back. Just slide it like this. All the screws on the laptop are the same size, so you shouldn't be worried about uh, getting one in the wrong place. So we just have to remove all the screws. This one here is uh, holding the CD. In my case, I don't have a CD, I have a dummy plastic. In this laptop, actually, I'm gonna install a SSD hard drive on the place of the regular disk. And I'm gonna put the, the disk that is uh, right now inside the laptop. I'm gonna use uh, this adapter here. It's a uh, 9.5 millimeter thick one so basically i'm gonna clone the operation system to this hard drive and we're gonna use it to install it on the laptop and we're gonna put the regular disk for a storage disk on this adapter here on the place of the cd if i have time i'll make a video what program do i use for cloning and a little explanation of course so since we got all the screws removed the only thing we got we gotta do now is just separate the plastic. You can use a sharp tool, you can use a, your uh, a knife, a cart, or whatever. Like this. And basically that's the whole thing. The CPU is uh, held by four screws here. If you like, you can remove also the, the fan to clean it. Uh, there's one screw here. Uh, I'm gonna also add a, a second bank of memory. Since right now it's with only uh, four gigabyte, I'm gonna add four more. I'm gonna remove this one here. Place uh, SSD in here and insert this disk into the adapter and hopefully it will get on the place because uh, this hard drive actually is 9.5 millimeter thick and the cut is 9.5 millimeter thick so it will be very very close uh, to for the adapter here let's hope it all work fine so i'll stop the video now and uh, make another video with the cloning process uh, after that. Uh, basically that's the whole procedure. After that, if uh, you like to replace the thermal paste, just clean everything and reassemble on the reverse. After that, put, just put back the battery and uh, that's the whole thing. I uh, hope you like the video. Bye bye for now.